Hey y'all, happy Thursday. Sorry I didn't get this out to you on Tuesday. Uh, it was Canadian Thanksgiving for those of you who didn't know that. So I enjoyed the weekend to myself. I took a couple days off of social media and just like spent time with my uh, friends and Scott. So um, that is why. But I'm super excited about today. It's another fashion overhaul and I literally just did a post today. I'm filming this on Wednesday, not Thursday. Um, I literally just did a post on this and so many people are wanting to see jackets. So I'm super pumped that in this one there are three jackets um, and then a couple shirts. So that's super exciting. But before I get into any of that, I actually want to do a quick shout out to my girl, Brittany, who um, who made this bunny hug. It's a, not even a bunny hug because it doesn't have the pockets. Like it's a, a cropped hoodie. So I bought it in an extra large. Her brand is called Perfectly Nude. And if you can see down here, it says perfect on it. And it's like kind of cut and it's... Um, it's like a distressed cut along the bottom as well. So it's like perfectly imperfect, which is like my whole slogan. I love um, when people are like, describe yourself and I'm like perfectly imperfect. I've always said that. And so I feel like her brand and I just resonate very well together. And I just love her as a human being and as everything. Uh, she's one of the One X models at Your Big Sister's Closet. And so go and support her and show her some love. She is a new entrepreneur and I'm so excited to see where this brand takes her. So yeah, it is like super soft. I love this cropped hoodie. Um, so yeah, that's that. I wanted to do a quick shout out to her because I love her. Um, unsponsored, she did not tell me that to do that. I just received this yesterday, so I'm super excited about that. Also, sorry about the hair. I'm literally just letting it air dry. I'm like, you guys don't mind. I threw some lashes on, didn't do any makeup other than my lashes. So we're just going with it. It's been one of those weeks. So um, I'm just gonna go with it. And I feel like these videos um, help me like mental health wise, like with it being so gloomy outside today, it's just, I've been so like, bleh, like just feeling like nothing. And um, I even went to the gym and stuff because usually that'll like perk me up. But just for some reason today, I'm just like, Whew. like nothing's gone wrong. And like nothing's happening. So I think that it's just like the weather change and all that kind of stuff, but I'm just feeling blah. So um, I wanted to share that with you because I like to share my real life, my real life. And this is my real life. Um, so I'm continuously focusing on positive things. I do not focus on the fact that I'm feeling blah. Um, instead, I'm forcing myself to do this video and I'm like, you know what? I wanna connect with my people. You guys are my people and just keep on pushing through because better days are ahead. Um, I'm always one that focuses on positive. Excuse you, ambulances trying to save people's lives. I'm here doing a video. If y'all could just zip for for just like a second, that would be fabulous. Thank you. Um, oh, they did listen. <laughs> um, but I hope people are okay. Just I want to do this video. Thank you. Uh, okay, so... Uh, yeah, I'm somebody who likes to focus on positive things and just um, thinking about the positivity because I feel like our whole lives are based on thoughts and um, I feel like we're just so quick to like go to the negative, go to the defensive, go to the like the worst case scenario and um, so I just focus on everything positive when I feel myself going to that space because I actually used to be like a super negative person like a long time ago. So that's a little bit about me. I'm like sharing, this is like therapy, holy. I don't talk about like my past a whole heck of a lot. Um, but yeah, I used to be a, a very, very, very negative person and I completely changed that around. And so when I feel myself going into 
those um, moments, I will just focus on everything around me that's positive because I feel like we miss a lot of the things that have happened, a lot of things that are going to happen, like things that are coming up, all that kind of stuff. So um, yeah, I'm gonna quit rambling on about that kind of stuff, but I wanted to share a little bit with you about me um, and like, I'm human and I think like I have my bad days like everybody else, um, but that's how I get through it is just thinking of positive things. Like fashion. You know, these sirens, I have the door open because it's like chillier outside, but I might have to shut it if these sirens don't stop. I live right downtown Toronto and there aren't typically a whole lot of sirens. I don't know, maybe you guys have noticed it more than I have. Today I'm just noticing it, maybe because the door is open, I don't know, but uh... We are going to, we're going to do this. We're going to do uh, fashion because fashion makes me happy. Dressing up makes me happy, even though I don't have the energy to like put on makeup and do my hair today. Um, it, it honestly makes me happy. So being able to make a difference out there and show these clothes on a real body is something that I personally treasure like a whole heck of a lot. And the ability to like, I'm going to start crying. Who are you today, Carrie? Oh my goodness. Um, I've received a lot of DMs lately and that's what's making me so emotional um, about the lives that I've changed and you just don't realize it when you're sitting here doing these videos and you're doing these posts every day. Why am I crying? Um, it just honestly, it means the world to me that I am making a difference and I want to continue to make a difference. So let's get into clothes because I don't like crying. <laughs> um, but thank you guys. I do want to say thank you guys. I'm super grateful for you. And that is why I'm doing this video today. So today's video brought to you by The Carrie Kemp. If you aren't following me on Instagram, please go on to Instagram. It's The Carrie Kemp spelled just like this. Um, and yeah, it's, it's me, this video. <laughs> my mind is so shot today y'all okay we're gonna just do it so I'm gonna start by doing my measurements alrighty honestly it my bust is at 111 which means like new beginnings in numerology I'm not sure if you guys have ever heard of like numerology so maybe my bust is gonna bring some new beginnings here <laughs> all right 111 centimeters, 111 centimeters, or 30, uh, 43 and a half in the bust inches. And then we're gonna go tuck this under. And do, do, do. Get nice and close for 38. Oh, 38 ish. I'm gonna go around my belly, which is 50, and then my booty, which is 52 and a half. So those are my measurements. Sweet baby Jesus. For those of you who don't know, I do measurements um, to help with like a relation of sizing. So I can say I'm a 1X uh, on top or 2X on the bottom or a size 18, but it's like, what store is that really from? This is an extra large. Um, so I could be like, oh, I'm, a, I'm an extra large. But like if I went to H&M, I would not fit into their extra large. That's a good example of it. So there's that, but that's why I do that. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm ready to get into this. So, uh, we have six items coming to you today, three jackets and, uh, three tops. So you guys seen this one on Instagram recently. It is this beautiful fuchsia cropped top. This is in a 2XL. I ordered it in a size 
larger because I wanted it to be uh, quite a bit beggier and I wanted it to be longer. Um, it is $29.99 US. And yeah, let's just, I'm ready to just throw her on. So, ooh, okay. So hang this puppy up. All right, so it is called the Amara Cropped Sweater in Neon Fuchsia. So I'm gonna show you it up close. It's kind of like a knit material. I really, really, really like wearing this with high-waisted jeans because you can like tuck in the front here just like a touch and make it just look, I don't know, like it's like a bigger sweater. I don't know. I just, I like the tucked in look a little bit. It's super cute. Um, it does have like a bigger, wider neck turtleneck, which I appreciate. I used to make fun of turtlenecks. Like now I'm like wearing them and being comfortable. Um, it is super warm, it's super thick, uh, but it does, um, like it is knit. So when you're outside and you're wearing uh, just this, you definitely feel the wind come through. Um, but I absolutely love this. Oh. It is just so warm and cozy. Um, I know like a lot of you are comfortable with like the cropped look, but I feel like this is a great place to start with a crop look because it is a longer crop. But if you're not comfortable, you're not comfortable. I just personally absolutely love this. So there's that. All right, let's move on to the next. Top. I'm going to do all the tops and then all the jackets. So if you're just looking for the jackets, uh, fast forward to the end. That's okay. I'm not going to judge you. Um, and I won't know. <laughs> all right. Let's do... Do, do, do this one. So this is another... Uh, cropped sweater. It's got a little bit more of like a, a baggier sleeve Ooh. and it's wide neck. So I have tried all of these on, full disclosure. So there's that. Um, this one I got in do to do a 2x. So again, let's just throw it on. All right, so here is the sweater. The details on it, this is called the No Need to Think Tee in Heather Gray. And I got it in the 2X. So it does have like the off the shoulder look. So you can wear it like this or like right off the shoulder. It is cropped, and again, it is a little bit longer. Oh, did I say how much this was? This is $15 US. Um, it's got like a baggier sleeve, so those who are wanting to hide their arms, this is a great, great shirt for that because it's all hidden. Um, yeah, it's... I like how like the cuffs are just like thicker, goes around, um, it's, and again, this crop is a little bit longer. So for the, those of you who are wanting to start getting into crops, you like, this is kind of where I personally started, um, and then worked myself up shorter and shorter and shorter and shorter. And then it's like, bam, you get the whole belly. Get in my belly. <laughs> so, yeah, I love this one as well. It's nice and light. It's super, super, super light. Like, I feel like this is great for, like, just a casual girl's night in with some wine. Like, it's just super comfy, super cash, super, 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 super. And honestly, $15. 
I do know like a lot of people have been commenting about the duties and taxes. Unfortunately, I do receive all of these items. So I personally don't pay that. And so I will disclose that there probably is duty and taxes. I don't know how much and how it's calculated and any of that. So I'm sorry, but um, there is that plus the exchange rate. So keep that in mind when you are ordering. Um, but for $15, this and the exchange, I don't know how much taxes, duties and taxes would be on it, but it's a really reasonable price. But if you're from the States, like $15, it's pretty awesome. All right, so next I'm gonna move into this sweater, another cropped sweater, surprise, surprise. Um, got it in a 1X, and we am gonna tell you why in a second, but let's just uh, throw it on, all right? Ooh. All righty. So the reason I ordered, okay, let's get to the details on this. So this is called Taking You Back Sweatshirt in Rose. It is a 1X for $13 US, so another great price. The reason I got this one in a 1X is because it's kind of like a sweater, like a sweatshirt. And so I wanted everything to like hug me a little bit better. If it would have been oversized, it just would have looked too frumpy with it being like a sweatshirt type material. I find that it wouldn't have hugged in the smallest part of my body as much. So I wanted this one just to be a little bit tighter of a fit because the arms are skinnier. This is a little bit more huggy and I seen that on the model. So that it's all like personal preference. If you wanted an oversized look, feel free to, to, um, uh, size up. Sizing up will also make this a little bit longer. Uh, but just some things I want to have hug me and then some things I want uh, I want to be a little bit baggier. So like I'll look at like the arms and if the arms are baggy I would want the whole thing to be baggy kind of thing. That's kind of how I roll and how I make decisions. But I absolutely love this. It is a great material, like it's nice and soft. It's fairly thick. I actually think that I'm gonna have something printed on it just because it's a, a plain shirt. So I think I'm, I'm gonna get something put on. I'm not gonna tell you what it is yet, but I do, I do wanna have something printed on it. So I am gonna do that one of these days. But it's just like a great plain uh, crop. Again, it's nice and long, so if this is the first time wearing a crop, this is a great place to start. Yeah, you get a little bit of VBO, but you know what? You only live once, and I really just don't care what other people think anymore. I want to be comfortable, and I want to feel sexy, and if I look in the mirror and I like what I see, that's all that matters, and that's all that should matter to you. It shouldn't be, oh, what's this person going to say? Because it does not matter. Their opinions matter zero your opinion and the way you feel about yourself is the only thing that should matter. And clothing is one way of like bringing out that confidence. I know that they say confidence comes from within, but if you like, if you get on that dress and you do your hair and your makeup, honey, you are feeling yourself and that confidence is going to show every single time. So, um, I, yes, confidence comes from within and I completely agree with that statement. However, when you look good and you know, you look good and you're feeling yourself, that's how confidence is built as well. So let's, let's get that record straight right there. But yeah, I, I really do love this. So I'm loving all of these tops. I'm going to quickly get into a black. Uh, just tank top to show you the um, the jackets. So here we go. All right. So uh, just threw on a black tank that has dog hair on it already. I love my dog, but whew, she sheds. She sheds. All right. So the first jacket I want to show you is this one. I love, love, love this jacket. It is called 
belted my cold heart puffer jacket in mauve. I got it in a 3X because remember the last video with the jackets? That 2X was a little bit small. So I sized way up and I'm so glad that I did. Um, it is $50 US. And I love the jacket. I'm so glad that I sized up two on this one just because. So it has like a little belt. It's got pockets. It's got a hood. Nice little fur hood. Faux fur, I'm sure. I'm going to show you it nice and close. Boo. Pick a boo. Boo. Ah! <laughs> All right. So I, I love the length of this jacket. I love the fit of this jacket. Would this jacket last a really cold day in Canada? Hell to the no. But I will tell you that it will last a really cold fall day or early winter. So you're not gonna wear this jacket in like the coldest days, unless you're like just going out quickly and it's like one of those quick bam bam, thank you ma'am. But um, but yeah, it is just like a super cute, like for um, winter family photos, I think that this would be absolutely adorable. I just find, I love the, the puffer in it. I love the belt. I'm gonna show you how the belt works. So it's just like this, and you go in, pull. It is a removable belt. So if you don't like the belt, you don't have to have it on there. You get, I don't know, this with it, I guess. <laughs> but I, I'm obsessed with this. It's kind of like it's nice and puffy and like it's just it's comfortable. It's cute. I cannot wait to do a photo shoot in it. Can you imagine be, having like a little pregnant belly just being like, ooh, it's so cute. Um, with the 3X there is a lot of room. So um, I probably could have sized down to 2X but it would probably be on the brink of being too small so I'm super happy that I sized up anyway just because it's super comfy like this so all right let's move on to the next jacket this is so cute I freaking love this you should have seen the box that I got all of this stuff in you take it like a bag Scott was like what what did you get I'm like oh it's fashion know this stuff and I I knew uh, what I was receiving as well, so I actually like tracked that kind of stuff this time. So um, I was like, yeah, it makes sense that they would put it in a box because like this stuff, like the jackets especially, when you're, when you're getting jackets, um, it takes, takes up a lot more room. All right, so the next item is this cute, cute, cute bomber. And I've seen so many people wearing very similar ones to this. I absolutely love the color. So this one is a Shea Satin Bomber in Burgundy. I got it in a 2X. It is $20 US. I love how it has an actual pocket here. It won't fit your phone, but um, it's just cute. I want to show you the inside of it. I personally would keep this undone, and I'm going to show you why in a second. All right. Boop, boop. I find, personally, this is just my own personal opinion, I find that this jacket is just a smidgen too long. So if it cut off here, I find that that would be like the perfect bomber jacket. But um, if I do that, then it's just like, it looks all frumpy here. Like it does have this elastic, but see how it like frumps when I do that? So I would want to wear it down here, but it just doesn't, 
It's not supposed to be worn down there. So, no. I'm just, like, I like it. It's a great quality jacket for, um, for $20 US. This is an amazing jacket. If I would have sized down, would it have been shorter? Probably not, not as short as I want it to be. Um, so it is a little bit longer. So I will for sure be selling this because like, I just have so many bomber jackets, but I love the color and actually it looks really cute open. So if you like these kind of bomber jackets, I do have an Instagram account that I um, upload once a month to with everything that I'm gonna be selling in the month. Um, just clothes that I am I typically don't wear. So make sure that you're following that account. It is at shop the carry camp or shop underscore the carry camp or something like that. Um, I'll link it right here so that you guys know. Um, but yeah, I love the color. It's just, it's honestly, I feel like it's just good for an open jacket in my opinion. But for 20 bucks, it's not that bad. It's a cute jacket for 20 bucks. American. All right, last but certainly not least is my favorite, 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 favorite jacket, favorite jacket ever. <laughs> and again, this one is actually, it's just like a carry jacket. <laughs> Let's just be real. It's carry blue. It's carry. It's me. Um, we're all good. Faux fur jacket in aqua. It is forty dollars U.S. It has buttons to do up. Oh, and I got it in size two X. I think I said that. I'm sorry. So Canadian. I'm sorry. All right, so there it is done up. It's so freaking cute. I don't like how it like V's there, but like honestly, if that's the worst thing about the jacket. So I actually really like this one done open as well. And so that is why I'm likely gonna be selling that one because I already have this one, which I find just a little bit more like fashion forward and like statement-y than the bomber jacket. And I have other bomber jackets. Um, is because this one is like the perfect have open jacket. I wore it with um, a black jumpsuit and I got so many compliments on my outfit that day. Like it was insane. So it was just a whole look and I was feeling myself. And so yeah. It has a hood, which is so cute. And like this fur, this faux fur, it literally feels like those freaking teddy bears. You know those teddy bears that you just like cuddle in Costco or Walmart or every store that sells teddy bears? Yeah, I don't judge me, okay? Okay. Um, I absolutely love this jacket. It honestly, of the whole haul, this is my favorite. Um, if I want to go and order, you guys like me to do that. So I'm going to go with this jacket, the fuchsia pink, um, shirt, and then the other jacket and then the other pink and then gray and then bomber. So that's in about the order that I, but I, I actually really like everything that I received. Um, I've been super impressed with Fashion Nova since I've started working with them. Um, and I'm super excited to uh, continue working with them. So stay tuned. I did a poll on my Instagram uh, asking what everybody likes and wants to see more of. And it sounds like jackets, which this haul is really good for, uh, and shirts and jeans. So those are uh, the main ones and a dress here and there. I think I'm going to do very sporadic dresses and just stick to like the everyday wear. Like not everybody wears dresses every day. I certainly don't wear dresses every day. So there is that. But without further ado, I think that is enough of my rambling. I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. I will see you guys at your big sister's closet. You guys always like watching your big sister's closet um, on Friday. And 
yeah, I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. I just said that. I'm losing my mind. Um, I love you guys so much. I'm super, super, super grateful. I actually already feel better doing this filming. So I want to thank you guys for giving me this opportunity to be creative. And um, it already made my day better. So that's a win, win, win in my books. Thank you guys so much. I love you. You have no idea how much you all mean to me. Mwah. Bye.